Governor says uh, Medicaid expansion in state of the state and the Republican legislative leaders, uh, they don't say dead on arrival, but they pre pretty much say don't do that because we're not going to do it. So then why do it? We're going to, because that's what the people of Wisconsin want. I mean, the will of the people is the law of the land. And that's something he talked about in his state of the state address. And that is something that you, up and down the board, no matter where you go, you can talk to health industry advocates. They believe that it is something that is the right thing to do for our state. You can talk to the Wisconsin families. They believe it's the right thing to do for our state. We're taking our directions from the people of the state. And that's what they've said that they've wanted. And that's why it's going to be in our budget. The reason I'm, a, uh, I'm against, quite honestly, is because over the years, uh, Medicaid is underfunded the true cost of the program. They only pay about 65 cents on the dollar for the true cost of delivering that health care. So taxpayers uh, who have private insurance are actually picking that up to a tune of about 30 cents uh, on the dollar additional cost for them, as well as also paying for it through uh, through their taxes. So I have not been a proponent of Medicaid expansion, So, and I don't believe that uh, any proposal that the Evers administration will put forward will get Republican uh, uh, general Republican support as well.